Beechcraft Model 18, or Twin Beach, as it is also known, is a 6 to 11 seat, twin engined, low wing, tailwheel light aircraft manufactured by the Beach Aircraft Corporation of Wichita, Kansas. Continuously produced from 1937 to November 1969, over 32 years, a world record at the time, over 9,000 were built, making it one of the world's most widely used light aircraft. Sold worldwide as a civilian executive, utility, cargo aircraft, and passenger airliner on tail wheels, nose wheels, skis, or floats, it was also used as a military aircraft. During and after World War II, over 4,500 Beach 18 saw military service as light transport, light bomber, for China, aircrew trainer, for bombing, navigation, and gunnery, photo reconnaissance, and mothership for target drones including United States Army Air Forces, USAF, C-45 Expeditor, AT-7 Navigator, AT-11 Kansan, and United States Navy, USN, UC-45J Navigator, SNB-1 Kansan, and others. In World War II, over 90% of USAF bombardiers and navigators trained in these aircraft. In the early post-war era, the Beach 18 was the preeminent business aircraft and feeder airliner. Besides carrying passengers, its civilian uses have included aerial spraying, sterile insect release, fish seeding, dry ice cloud seeding, aerial firefighting, air mail delivery, ambulance service, numerous movie productions, skydiving, freight, weapon and drug smuggling, engine test bed, sky riding, banner towing, and stunt aircraft. Many are now privately owned, around the world, with 240 in the U.S. still on the FAA aircraft registry in August 2017. Design and Development By the late 1930s, Beechcraft management speculated that a demand would exist for a new design dubbed the Model 18, which would have a military application, and increase the main production facilities. The design was mainly conventional for the time, including twin radial engines, all-metal semi monoco construction with fabric-covered control surfaces and tailwheel undercarriage. Less conventional was the twin tail fin configuration. The Model 18 can be mistaken for the larger Lockheed Electra series of airliners which closely resemble it. Early production aircraft were powered either by two 330 HP, 250 kilowatts, Jacobs L6S or 350 HP, 260 kilowatts, Wright R760ES. The 450 HP, 336 kilowatts, Pratt & Whitney R985 became the definitive engine from the pre-war C-18S onwards. The Beach 18 prototype first flew on January 15. 1937. The aircraft has used a variety of engines and has had a number of airframe modifications to increase gross weight and speed. At least one aircraft was modified to a 600 HP, 447 kW, Pratt & Whitney R1340 power plant configuration. With the added weight of about 200 pounds, 91 kg, per engine, the concept of a Model 18 fitted with R1340 engines was deemed unsatisfactory due to the weakest structural area of the aircraft being the engine mounts. Nearly every airframe component has been modified. In 1955, deliveries of the Model E18S commenced, the E18S featured a fuselage that was extended 6 in, 150 mm, higher for more headroom in the passenger cabin. All later Beach 18s, sometimes called Super 18s, featured this taller fuselage, and some earlier models, including one at 11, have been modified to this larger fuselage. The Model H18, introduced in 1963, featured optional tricycle undercarriage. Unusually, the undercarriage was developed for earlier model aircraft under an STC by Valpar, and installed in H18S at the factory during manufacture. A total of 109 hours 18 seconds were built with tricycle undercarriage, and another 240 earlier model aircraft were modified with this. Construction of the Beechcraft Model 18 ended in 1970 with the final Model H-18 going to Japan Airlines. Through the years, 
32 variations of the basic design had flown, over 200 improvement modification kits were developed, and almost 8,000 aircraft were built. In one case, the aircraft was modified to a triple tail, trigear, humpbacked configuration and appeared similar to a miniature Lockheed constellation. Another distinctive conversion was carried out by Pacero as the trade wind. This featured a lengthened nose to accommodate the tricycle nose wheel, and the Model 18's twin tail fins were replaced by a single fin. Operational History Production got an early boost when Nationalist China paid the company 750,000 US dollars for six M18R light bombers, but by the time of the US entry into World War II, only 39 Model 18s had been sold, of which 29 were for civilian customers. Work began in earnest on a variant specifically for training military pilots, bombardiers, and navigators. The effort resulted in the Army at 7 and Navy SNB. Further development led to the AT-11 and SNB-2 navigation trainers and the C-45 military transport. The United States Air Force, U.S. Air Force, Strategic Air Command had Model 18 variants, AT-11 Kansans, C-45 Expeditors, F-2 Expeditors, the F standing for Photo Recon, short for Photographic Reconnaissance, and UC-45 Expeditors, from 1946 until 1951. From 1951 to 1955, the U.S. Air Force had many of its aircraft remanufactured with new fuselages, wing center sections, and undercarriages to take advantage of the improvements to the civil models since the end of World War II. Eventually, 900 aircraft were remanufactured to be similar to the then current Model D-18S and given new designations, constructors numbers, and Air Force serial numbers. The USN had many of its surviving aircraft remanufactured as well, these being redesignated as SNB-5S and SNB-5PS. The C-45 flew in U.S. Air Force service until 1963, the USN retired its last SNB in 1972, while the U.S. Army flew its C-45S until 1976. In later years, the military called these aircraft bug smashers in reference to their extensive use supplying mandatory flight hours for desk-bound aviators in the Pentagon. Beach 18s were used extensively by Air America during the Vietnam War, initially more or less standard ex-military C-45 examples were used, but then the airline had 12 aircraft modified by Conrad conversions in 1963 and 1964 to increase performance and load-carrying capacity. The modified aircraft were known as Conrad 10-2s, as the maximum takeoff weight, MTOW, was increased to 10,200 pounds, 4,600 kilograms. The increase was achieved by several airframe modifications, including increased horizontal stabilizer angle of incidence, redesigned undercarriage doors, and aerodynamically improved wingtips. Air America then had Volpar convert 14 aircraft to turboprop power, fitted with Garrett Air Search TPE-331 engines, modified aircraft were called Volpar Turbo Beaches, and also had a further increase in MTOW to 10,286 pounds, 4,666 kilograms. Spar Problems The wing spar of the Model 18 was fabricated by welding an assembly of tubular steel. The configuration of the tubes in combination with drilled holes from aftermarket STC modifications on some of these aircraft have allowed the spar to become susceptible to corrosion and cracking while in service. This prompted the FAA to issue an airworthiness directive in 1975, mandating the fitting of a spar strap to some Model 18s. This led, in turn, to the retirement of a large number of STC modified Model 18s when owners determined the aircraft were worth less than the cost of the modifications. The corrosion on unmodified spars was not a problem, and occurred due to the additional exposed surface area created through the STC hole drilling process. Further requirements have been mandated by the FAA and other national airworthiness authorities, including regular removal of the spar strap to allow the strap to be checked for cracks and corrosion and the spar to be x-rayed. In Australia, the airworthiness authority has placed a life limit on the airframe, beyond which aircraft are not allowed to fly. Variants 
manufacturer models. Unless otherwise noted, the engines fitted are Pratt & Whitney R985 radials. Model 18A First production model with seating for two pilots and seven or eight passengers, fitted with Wright R760E2 engines of 350 horsepower, 260 kilowatts, MTOW, 6,700 pounds, 3,000 kilograms. Model S18A Version of Model 18A capable of being fitted with skis or Edo 55 to 7,170 floats, MTOW, 7,200 pounds, 3,300 kilograms. Model 18B Improved model with increased range and useful load, fitted with 285 HP, 213 kilowatts, Jacobs L5 engines. Model S18B Version of Model 18B capable of being fitted with skis or floats. Model 18D Variant with seating for two pilots and nine passengers, fitted with Jacobs L6 engines of 330 horsepower, 250 kilowatts, MTOW, 7,200 pounds, 3,300 kilograms. Model S18D Version of Model 18D capable of being fitted with skis or Edo 55 to 7,170 floats, MTOW, 7,170 pounds, 3,250 kilograms. Model A18D Variant of 18D with MTOW increased by 300 pounds, 140 kilograms, to 7,500 pounds, 3,400 kilograms, fitted with Pratt & Whitney R985 engines with 450 HP each. Model SA18D Seaplane version of Model A18D, but same MTOW as SA18D, fitted with Edo 55 to 7,170 floats. Model A18A Version fitted with Pratt & Whitney R985 engines of 450 horsepower, 340 kilowatts, MTOW, 7,500 pounds, 3,400 kilograms. Model SA18A Seaplane version of Model A18A, fitted with Edo 55 to 7,170 floats, MTOW, 7,170 pounds, 3,250 kilograms. Model 18R Model with Pratt & Whitney R985A1 engines with dual-stage blower for increased power at higher operating altitudes, 450 horsepower, 340 kilowatts, 7 built, 1 to Sweden as an air ambulance, 6 to nationalist China as M18R light bombers. Model 18S 9-passenger pre-World War II civil variant, served as basis for USAF C-45C. Model B-18S 9-passenger pre-World War II civil variant, served as basis for USAF F-2. Model C-18S Variant of B-18S with seating for 8 passengers and equipment and minor structural changes. Model D-18S First post-World War II variant introduced in 1945, with seating for 8 passengers and MTOW of 8,750 pounds, 3,970 kilograms, 1,035 built. Model D-18C Variant with Continental R9A engines of 525 horsepower, 391 kilowatts, and MTOW of 9,000 pounds, 4,100 kilograms, introduced in 1947, 31 built. Model E18S Variant with redesigned wing and MTOW of 9,300 pounds, 4,200 kilograms, 403 built. Model E18S 9700 Variant of E18S with MTOW of 9,700 pounds, 4,400 kilograms, 57 built. Model G18S Superseded E18S, MTOW of 9,700 pounds, 4,400 kilograms, 155 built. Model G18S 9150 Lightweight version of G18, 
MTOW of 9,150 pounds, 4,150 kilograms, one built. Model H18. Last production version, fitted with optional tricycle undercarriage developed by Valpar and MTOW of 9,900 pounds, 4,500 kilograms, 149 built, of which 109 were manufactured with tricycle undercarriage. Military versions. Yozak slash Yozaf designations. C-45. Six-seat staff transport based on C-18S, 11 built. C-45A. Eight-seat utility transport based on C-18S, 20 built. RC-45A. Redesignation of all surviving F-2, F-2A, and F-2B aircraft by the U.S. Air Force in 1948. C-45B. Based on C-18S, but with modified internal layout, 223 ordered, redesignated UC-45B in 1943. C-45C. Two Model 18S aircraft impressed into the USF, redesignated UC-45C in January 1943. C-45D. Designation given to two at seven aircraft converted as passenger transports during manufacture, redesignated UC-45D in January 1943. C-45E. Designation given to two at seven and four at seven B aircraft converted as passenger transports during manufacture, redesignated UC-45E in January 1943. C-45F. Standardized seven-seat version based on C-18S, with longer nose than preceding models, 1137 ordered, redesignated UC-45F. C-45G. At 7S and at 11S remanufactured in the early 1950s for the U.S. Air Force to similar standard as civil D-18S with autopilot and R-985 and three engines, 372 aircraft were built. TC-45G. Multi-engine crew trainer variant of C-45G, at 7S and at 11S remanufactured in the early 1950s for the U.S. Air Force to similar standard as civil D-18S, 96 aircraft rebuilt. C-45H. At 7S and at 11S remanufactured in the early 1950s for the U.S. Air Force to similar standard as civil D-18S, with no autopilot and R-985 and 14B engines, 432 aircraft were built. TC-45H. RC-45J. In 1962, all surviving U.S. Navy SNB-5PS were redesignated RC-45J. TC-45J. In 1962 all surviving U.S. Navy SNB-5S were redesignated TC-45J. UC-45J. C-45E. Designation given to two at seven and four at seven B aircraft converted as passenger transports during manufacture, redesignated UC-45E in January 1943. C-45F. Standardized seven-seat version based on C-18S, with longer nose than preceding models, 1137 ordered, Redesignated UC-45F. C-45G. At 7S and at 11S remanufactured in the early 1950s for the U.S. Air Force to similar standard as civil D-18S with autopilot and R-985 and three engines, 372 aircraft were built. TC-45G. Multi-engine crew trainer variant of C-45G, at 7S and at 11S remanufactured in the early 1950s for the U.S. Air Force to similar standard as civil D-18S, 96 aircraft were built. C-45H. At 7S and at 11S remanufactured in the early 1950s for the U.S. Air Force to similar standard as civil D-18S, with no autopilot and R-985 and 14B engines, 432 aircraft were built. TC-45H. RC-45J. In 1962, all surviving U.S. Navy SNB-5PS were redesignated RC-45J. TC-45J. 
In 1962 all surviving U.S. Navy SNB-5S were redesignated TC-45J. UC-45J. F2. Photo reconnaissance version based on B-18. F2A. Improved version. F2B. U.S. Navy designations. JRB-1. Photographic aircraft, based on the C-18S, fitted with fairing over cockpit for improved visibility, 11 built. JRB-2. Light transport, based on the C-18S, 15 built. JRB-3. Photographic version, similar to C-45B, 23 built. JRB-4. Utility transport version, equivalent to UC-45F, 328 built. JRB-6. SNB-1. Similar to at 11, 110 built. SNB-2. Navigation trainer similar to at 7, 299 built. SNB-2C. Navigation trainer. SNB-2H. Ambulance conversion. SNB-2P. Photo reconnaissance trainer. SNB-3. Navigation trainer. SNB-3Q. Electronic countermeasures trainer. SNB-5. SNB-2S and SNB-2CS were remanufactured, and designated SNB-5. SNB-5P. Photo reconnaissance trainer. RAF slash RCAF lend lease designations. Expediter I. C-45BS supplied to the RAF under lend lease. Expediter 2. C-45FS supplied to the RAF and Royal Navy under lend lease. Expediter 3. C-45FS supplied to the RCAF under lend lease. Post-war RCAF designations. C-45DS delivered between 1951 and 1952. Expediter 3N. Navigation trainer, 88 built. Expediter 3 nanometers. Navigational trainer that could be converted to a transport, 59 built. Expediter 3 NMT. 3 nanometers converted to a transport aircraft, 67 built. Expediter 3 NMT, special. Navigation trainer slash personnel transport, 19 built. Expediter 3 TM. Transport with fittings so it could be converted to a navigation trainer, 44 built. Expediter 3 TM, special. Modified RCAF expediters used overseas in conjunction with Project WPB6, 3 built. Conversions. POC Super 18S Tradewind. Custom conversion of Beach D 18S slash C45 to 5 to 11 seat executive transport by Pacific Air Motive. Hamilton Ha 1. Conversion of a TC 45J aircraft. Hamilton Little Liner. Modification of D 18S with aerodynamic improvements and new, retractable tail wheel, capable of carrying 11 seats. Hamilton Westwind. Turboprop conversions with various engines. Hamilton Westwind 2 STD. Stretched conversion powered by 2840 HP PT6 as, and with accommodation for up to 17 passengers. Hamilton Westwind 3. 2579 HP PT6 A20S or 630 HP PT6 A27S or 630 HP Lycoming LTS 101S. Hamilton Westwind 4. 2570 HP Lycoming LTP 101S or 680 HP PT 6A28S or 750 HP PT 6A34S or 1020 HP PT 6A45S. Valpar, Beechcraft, Model 18. Conversion of Model 18 with nose wheel undercarriage. Valpar, Beechcraft, Super 18. Valpar, Beechcraft, Turbo 18. Beach Model 18s fitted with the Valpar MKIV tricycle undercarriage and powered by 2705 HP Garrett TPE 331-1-101B turboprop engines, flat rated to 605 HP, 451 kW, driving Hartz LHCB 3TN53 blade, 
reversible pitch, constant speed feathering propellers. Valpar, Beechcraft, Super Turbo 18. 2x705 HP, 526 kW, Garrett TPE331. Valpar, Beechcraft, C45G. C45G aircraft modified with tricycle undercarriage. Valpar, Beechcraft, Turboliner. 15 passenger version of the Turbo 18 with extended fuselage, powered by 2705 HP Garrett TPE 331 1 101BS. Valpar, Beechcraft, Turboliner 2. Turboliners modified to meet SFAR 23. Operators Civil. As of 2012, the Beechcraft Model 18 remains popular with air charter companies and small feeder airlines worldwide. Military Argentina Argentine Air Force Argentine Naval Aviation Bolivia Bolivian Air Force Brazil Brazilian Air Force Canada Royal Canadian Air Force 394 examples from 1941 to 1972 Royal Canadian Navy 10 examples from 1952 to 1960. Chile. Chilean Air Force. Chilean Army. Chilean Navy. China slash Taiwan. Colombia. Colombian Air Force. Costa Rica. Cote d'Ivoire. Dominican Republic. Dominican Air Force. Ecuador. El Salvador. Air Force of El Salvador France French Air Force Guatemala Guatemalan Air Force Haiti Corps d'Aviation Honduras Honduran Air Force Indonesia Indonesian Army Indonesian Air Force Iran Italy Italian Air Force operated 125 aircraft from 1949 until the 1970s. Japan. Japan Maritime Self-Defense Force. Japan Coast Guard. Mexico. Mexican Air Force. Netherlands. Royal Netherlands Air Force. Dutch Naval Aviation Service. Nicaragua. Nicaraguan Air Force. Niger. Niger Air Force Nigeria Paraguay Paraguayan Air Force Peru Peruvian Air Force Philippines Philippine Army Air Corps Portugal Forca Area Portuguesa Somalia Somali Air Force, withdrawn in 1991 South Africa South African Air Force South Vietnam Republic of Vietnam Air Force Spain Sri Lanka Sri Lanka Air Force Sweden Swedish Air Force Switzerland Swiss Air Force Thailand Royal Thai Air Force Tonga Tongan Maritime Force Turkey Turkish Air Force United Kingdom Royal Air Force Royal Navy, Fleet Air Arm United States United States Army United States Army Air Corps United States Army Air Forces United States Air Force United States Marine Corps United States Navy Uruguay Venezuela Zahir Aircraft on display Argentina at 11A3495, at the Museo Nacional de Aeronautica de Argentina in Buenos Aires. C45H5621, at the Museo Nacional de Aeronautica de Argentina in Buenos Aires. C45HAF555, at the Museo Nacional de Aeronautica de Argentina in Buenos Aires. H18SC slash no. BA752, Former LVJFH, at the Museo Nacional de Aeronautica de Argentina in Buenos Aires. Australia. E18SC slash no. BA81, former N3781B, 
at the Queensland Air Museum in Caloundra, Queensland, Belgium. 3 nanometers float plane C/no CA191, former CFGNR at Perry Daza, Brazil. At 114,615 at the Musu Aeroespacial in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. C45F2856 at the Musu Aeroespacial in Rio de Janeiro, Brazil. Canada. C45H459 at the Canadian Bush Plain Heritage Centre in Salt Ste Marie, Ontario. Tail code CFMJY. 3TM8034, at the Canadian Bush Plain Heritage Centre in Salt Ste Marie, Ontario. D18SC slash NO. A141, former CFMPH, at the RCMP Academy, Depot Division in Regina, Saskatchewan. D18SC slash no. A142, former CFMPI, at the Bomber Command Museum of Canada in Nanton, Alberta. D18SC slash no. A156, at the Canadian Warplane Heritage Museum in Hamilton, Ontario. D18S3TM6596, former CFSIF, former RCAF1387, at the Reynolds Alberta Museum in Wetaskiwin, Alberta. 3NC slash no. A652, former RCAF 1477, at the Royal Aviation Museum of Western Canada in Winnipeg, Manitoba. 3NMTC slash no. A700, at the Canadian Air Land Sea Museum at Toronto slash Markham Airport in Markham, Ontario. 3 nanometers C slash no. A710, at the North Atlantic Aviation Museum in Gander, Newfoundland and Labrador. 3 NMTC slash no. A782, former CFCKT, at the Canadian Museum of Flight in Langley, British Columbia. 3 NMTC slash no. A872, at the TransCanada Highway in Ignace, Ontario. 3 nanometers C slash no. A895, at the Alberta Aviation Museum in Edmonton, Alberta. Chile. D18SC slash no. A1024, former FOC 465, at the Museo Aeronautico y del Espacio in Santiago, Chile. India. D18S Identity Unknown, at the Hotel Mayfair Lagoon in Bhubaneshwar, Orissa. Italy. C 45 F 6668, suspended inside the Albia Costa Smeralda Airport passenger terminal in Albia, Sardinia. This was the first aircraft owned by Alice Arda Airlines and was used in the filming of the movie The Last Emperor. Malta. C 45 H 8304, under restoration at the Malta Aviation Museum in Takalai, Malta. Netherlands. C 45 G 51 to 11665, at the Aviadrome in Lelystad, Netherlands. New Zealand. At 113691, at the Museum of Transport and Technology in Auckland, New Zealand. Portugal. At 112504, at the Musu do AR in Sintra, Portugal. Spain. C 45 HAF 752, at Fundacion Infante de Orleans in Madrid, Spain. Turkey. At 11 Kansan 6390 9 930, at Istanbul Aviation Museum. United Kingdom. E 18 SC slash no. BA 111, former N 575C, at the National Museum of Flight in East Lothian, Scotland. United States. At 11412761 at the National Museum of the U.S. Air Force in Dayton, Ohio. Or 42 to 37,493. At 11B41 to 27,616 at the Travis Air Force Base Heritage Center at Travis AFB, California. At 1142 to 36,887 at the Barksdale Global Power Museum in Bossier City, Louisiana. 
at 1142 to 37,240, at the Lone Star Flight Museum in Galveston, Texas. UC 4542 to 37,496, at the Wings Over the Rockies Air and Space Museum in Denver, Colorado. This aircraft was originally an at 11 before being remanufactured. UC 45 F44 to 47342 at the Alaska Aviation Heritage Museum in Anchorage, Alaska. TC 45 H51 to 11529 at the Tri-State Warbird Museum in Batavia, Ohio. C 45 H51 to 11696 at the Museum of Flight in Seattle, Washington. C 45 G 51 to 11795 at the Air Mobility Command Museum in Dover, Delaware. C 45 G 51 to 11897 at the Castle Air Museum in Atwater, California. C 45 H 52 to 10539 at the 1941 Historical Aircraft Group Museum in Genesio, New York. C 45 H 52 to 10865 at the Travis Air Force Base Heritage Center at Travis AFB, California. C 45 H 52 to 10893 at the National Museum of the U.S. Air Force in Dayton, Ohio. UC 45 J 23774 at Laughlin AFB in Del Rio, Texas. RC 45J51233 at the Tennessee Museum of Aviation in Sevierville, Tennessee. UC 45J51242 at the CAF Central Texas Wing in San Marcos, Texas. UC 45J51291 at the Aerospace Museum of California in Sacramento, California. UC 45J51338, at the Minnesota Air National Guard Museum in St. Paul, Minnesota. S18DC slash NO 178, at the Beechcraft Heritage Museum in Tullahoma, Tennessee. D18SC slash NO. A935, at the Beechcraft Heritage Museum at Tullahoma Regional Airport in Tullahoma, Tennessee. C45HAF824, at the Beechcraft Heritage Museum in Tullahoma, Tennessee. E18SC slash NO. BA453, at the Beechcraft Heritage Museum in Tullahoma, Tennessee. H18C slash NO. BA670, at the Lone Star Flight Museum in Galveston, Texas. Specifications, UC45 Expediter. General Characteristics. Crew, 2 Pilots. Capacity, 6 passengers. Length, 34 feet 2 in, 10.41 m. Wingspan, 47 feet 8 in, 14.53 m. Height, 9 feet 8 in, 2.95 m. Wing area, 349 square feet, 32.4 square meters. Empty weight, 6,175 pounds. 2,800 kilograms. Loaded weight, 7,500 pounds, 3,400 kilograms. Max takeoff weight, 8,727 pounds, 3,959 kilograms. Power plant, 2 times Pratt and Whitney R985 and 1 Wasp Jr. radial engines, 450 HP, 336 kilowatts each. Performance. Maximum speed, 225 miles per hour, 195 knots, 360 kilometers per hour. Range, 1,200 miles, 1,000 nanometers, 1,900 kilometers, at 160 miles per hour, 260 kilometers per hour. Service ceiling, 26,000 feet, 7,930 m. Rate of climb, 1,850 feet slash min, 9.4 m slash s. Roll trainer and utility aircraft. National origin United States. Manufacturer Beach Aircraft Corporation. First flight January 15, 
1937. Introduction 1937. Primary Users United States Army Air Forces. United States Navy. Royal Air Force. Royal Canadian Air Force. Produced 1937 to 1970. Number built 9,000 plus. Unit cost. D18S, 78,050 US dollars in 1952. Please subscribe and thanks for watching.